Howdy guys, welcome to the video for Elden Ring. My name is Vindus SGN. In this video, I'm going to show you what to do and where to go once you defeat Godric to continue the story going forward. The game is really open world, but if you're like me and you still want a little more instruction before you start going wherever you want, there is still more that the game can tell you in that regard. Also, you'll be able to get a pretty powerful plus 8 sword for basically free if you follow this method. Before I get into that though, please subscribe to this channel and if you have any questions, feel free to leave them down in the comments. Alright, so once you defeat Godric, the game doesn't give you any more instruction without you asking for it. And the way that you do that is to head back to the Grace site for the first step. The place where you first spawned into the open world map and talk to an NPC seen here. This NPC is here and waiting for you. They will instruct you to go and talk to the two fingers in the Table of Lost Grace. Head on over there and talk to the gnarly old crone on top of the table. Listen to their nonsense or skip it. Either way, once you're done with that, head back to the Grace site for the first step. The NPC will be gone, but there will be a message there telling you to head to the Rose Church seen here on the map. Teleport to the Fallen Ruins of the Lake Grace site for easy access to the Rose Church. Once you get there, the NPC will be there and he will ask you about the things the Two Fingers said. Answer with this, they didn't seem right. And the NPC will give you a conspiracy theory, then give you a bloody finger. And from there, you can enter into the Rose Church and fight with the Blood Knight. After you defeat him, head back to the Round Table and talk with Sir Gideon. He has a lot to tell you and basically gives you hints as to what your next goal should be. He basically tells you to go and clear out Rhea Lucaria Academy in Liernia. But to do that, you will need an Academy key. Please, see my video on how to get one of those keys once you are ready. Before you head off on that adventure, there is one more person in the Table of Lost Grace that you need to talk to and that is Rajair. If while you were in Stormvale Castle, you ran into Rajair and he taught you some spells. Now, I'm not sure if it's a prerequisite for you to interact with Rajair in Stormvale beforehand or not, but I did and I found him here in this room and talked with him. He gave me a sword, a plus 8 rapier that actually does impressive damage to the boss fight in Rhea Lucaria Academy. I enhanced it even further with stones I could purchase and got it up to a plus 13, so it is basically one of the strongest weapons in my inventory. For more information on Rhea Lucaria Academy, please check out my channel and see the videos about the Lazuli Glintstone Sword as well as how to get into Rhea Lucaria Academy. Both are extremely helpful videos on getting into and exploring the Academy. Thank you so much for watching and have a great rest of your day. Peace out.